Family, what the family wants with the community is to give them a time to grieve uh, for their mother, for their his wife, uh, give them a time to process this, uh, to not engage in, in this schadenfreude and this, this uh, reveling in the misfortune of others, and, and to think what they would be like in that type of situation, how it would be so hurtful to hear about things on the news that aren't true, to hear about things through the paper that aren't true, and to just give this family a chance to like grieve and, and let the system they're grieving for mom, and on the other hand, they've got dad wandering around, and they're wondering, you know, midway through the night in question, uh, while mom is still laying there in the bedroom, dad's being led away by sheriffs. Um, so it, it's, it's a lot to process. It's more than anybody should have to process. But they're doing their best and they're very tight in their support for dad. What would you say, uh, what, what about the effect on the kids? Tell me a little bit more that, about that. It's, it's just they're, they, they don't know how to process this. They're, they're going about their business, but they're just going through the motions right now. I'm sure every waking moment there's thoughts of mom and, and then thoughts of dad at the same time. It's a very, very hard process. It's a process I hope nobody else has to go through. They're, but they're doing their best. They're all rallied around their father.